The Hour of Power Meditation Gently let yourself become comfortable lying down or sitting, relax, soften the eyes, soften the mind. Center yourself, focus yourself. This is a communication with your higher self. You will be strengthening the conduit of communication from your higher mind to your physical mind. Training your physical mind to be a better receiver from the higher mind and all the information that the higher mind sends you to guide you into the true being that you are. Repeat the phrase and feel the vibration frequency of the statement. And allow all these statements then to become a master frequency of shifting your consciousness, raising your vibration and expanding your awareness. This meditation and this frequency is to create inner peace, allow you to feel more strongly and connected to your indestructible core of your nature of your being. Creating a bubble reality that will allow you to glide smoothly through the changes around you and within you. We go through the statements, allow yourself to meditate on each statement and feel the frequency. And also we describe each statement. I am who I am for a reason. I am who I am for a reason. You are unique. If you exist, then all that is needs you to exist, for without you it will not be all that is. Allow the statement to be an honoring of your existence, an honoring of your uniqueness. You are who you are for a reason. Your mission, your purpose in life, no matter how you may choose to express the purpose, is fundamentally to be yourself, your unique self, as fully as you can. Which is why it is so important to act on your passion, to follow your joy, since the energy and your physical translation is representative of the core frequency, your true self. It is for the purpose of honoring your existence and the fact that you are worthy of that existence and the fact that you belong in existence or you wouldn't exist because creation doesn't make mistakes. I am who I am for a reason. No insistence, no resistance. No insistence, no resistance. 
Insistence in your life on a particular thing that must happen is a form of resistance of what could be there, much better than you can even imagine. Allow resistance in your life to melt away and allow synchronicity to bring what you truly need. Relax the idea of the ego's insistence of what it wants so that you can truly receive what you actually need and that what would benefit you best in your life. No insistence, then there will be no resistance. Let yourself flow. You have your own current in the river of creation. The current already knows where you need to go. Let yourself go with the flow. Relax, go with the flow and you will wind up exactly where you need to be exactly when you need to be there. Perfect timing. No insistence, no resistance. I am an indestructible being at my core. I am an indestructible being at my core. The fact that you exist cannot be changed. You can change the form of your existence. You can change the expression, the experience of your existence. But the fact that you exist is fundamental. That will never change. Feel that indestructibility in your core. I am an indestructible being at my core.
past and the future are illusions. There is only now. The past and the future are illusions. There is only now. Now is all there is. We as humans have created illusion of time to help experience process in a certain way. The so-called past and the so-called future are simply alternate nows existing simultaneously with whatever now you believe you are experiencing at this moment. We are shifting into the future or shifting from the past. You are actually just shifting into an alternate now. So the way we experience things as shifting from the past into the future is a form of linear perspective. But in reality, everything exists in this moment, all at once. All is now, all is here. All is within your consciousness. You are here and now. The past and the future are illusions. There is only now. Everything happens in perfect timing. I will miss nothing. Everything happens in perfect timing. I will miss nothing. Everything that needs to happen in your life, if you focus on what you need, will come to you exactly when you need it. It is not possible for you to miss any agreements, any appointments that you have made that are relevant for you to experience in your life. Worrying and focusing that you will miss it will allow you to miss it. But if you do not worry, if you are going to miss something important, relevant, you will not miss a thing. Nothing will be left out for this is the nature and definition of acting on your passion. It contains everything that is relevant for you, specifically for you in your life. Your passion designed to harmonize with your frequency and it automatically contains everything you need and will unfold if you allow it to, in perfect timing. Nothing will be left out. That is important for you to experience in your life. If it is not there, you don't need it. Let it go. Everything happens in perfect timing. I will miss nothing.
My life is my own. No one can live it for me. My life is my own. No one can live it for me. No one can really know what's best for you. Advice can be taken, listened to, and you can assess it whether it is true for you or not. Ultimately, you have to decide who you are, who you prefer to be, and what the path of least resistance is for you. When it comes right down to it, you are the only one that can decide what is really true for you. If you explore yourself with honesty and clarity, you will know the difference between what really is your excitement and what really is your fear. You will know what direction is really true for you and by choosing the thing that is really true for you is the best way of honoring everyone else, including your parents or family, even if they don't believe that your choices are of best benefit to you. If you have explored and done your due diligence within yourself to know at best as you can at any given moment who you truly know yourself to be, which doesn't mean you won't change, which doesn't mean you won't know more later, which doesn't mean you won't get better, of course you will, but at every given moment you are a perfect representation of who you are at this moment and in the next moment. Even though you may change and learn more and do things differently, you will then simply be a different perfect, not a more perfect. And you're never a less perfect. You're just a different perfect. No one can really live your life. No one can know what is best for you. My life is my own. No one can live it for me. I am unconditionally supported by creation. I am unconditionally supported by creation. Unconditionally. You are absolutely supported with no conditions. Anything you choose or believe is supported. So unconditionally loved, unconditionally supported, that you are even allowed to believe that you are not loved and not supported. That is how supported and loved you are. You are allowed to believe anything, even things that are not really so. You are free to choose anything that you wish to believe. That is how supported you are. I am unconditionally supported by creation.
I am an expression of nature. I am an expression of nature. You do not live in nature. You do not live with nature. You are nature. You are an expression of that that is natural. There is nothing that is supernatural, paranormal or metaphysical. It is all natural. It is all normal. It is all part of nature. There are higher energies that are non-physical that you can tap into. Parts of ourselves are non-physical and unseen. That doesn't mean it's supernatural. It simply makes them another form of nature. You are an expression of nature. Do not separate or segregate yourself out of the idea of being part of the natural world, the natural universe. You are an expression of nature and knowing that and acting on that will help you to make all the connections to other expressions of nature that are important for you to experience your reality in a holistic way rather than a jumbled collection of parts that seem disconnected from one another. The more you connect to the true nature of your being, the easier it will be for you to connect to all other expressions of nature as well and see yourself as an expression of an holistic system. I am an expression of nature. I always have exactly what I need. I always have exactly what I need. Everything that comes to you, even if it is something in the moment that you recognize that you don't prefer, must be there for a reason. If you stay in a positive state with it, and stay with it in that moment with knowing it is what you need to move on to the next best place, you will relate to it in a positive way and be capable of extracting a positive effect from it, no matter how it looks, no matter how it originated, no matter what anybody's opinion is of it. If you remain in a positive state with it, you will extract a positive effect from it. Stay in a positive state. You will be able to use it in a positive way. I always have exactly what I need. You have everything you need. The manifestation will happen in perfect timing. Everything you need is right here, right now. Nothing is missing. Nothing is missing. It may seem invisible to you, but that is only because that is not the time for that to manifest solidly. It is not necessarily the time for that to come into your awareness. There might be a process for you to go through so that when it does manifest, you will have a deeper appreciation of exactly how to use it. Everything you need is right here, right now, already. You are missing nothing. I always have exactly what I need.
I give and receive joy, love and compassion. I give and receive joy, love and compassion. I give and receive joy, love and compassion. That is what you are. You are joy. You are love. You are given unconditional support, love and compassion. Why not reflect it? That is what will allow you to feel the connection to creation to all that is. That is the frequency of existence itself. So why not harmonize with that and know that you are giving and receiving it. And by being of service, by giving it, is the best way for you to open up as fully as you can to receive it and experience it for yourself. It is always being given to you. You don't really have to ever ask for it. Because the idea is that asking for something is not asking for something you don't have. You are never in lack. You can ask, but understand that asking is simply asking to be more aware of what you are already being given. That's a big difference. Because you have everything that you need. You just need to pay attention to that fact. And you will experience that it is so. I can give and receive love, joy and compassion. My life is a synchronous orchestration. My life is a synchronous orchestration. Absolutely. Every moment is orchestrated through synchronicity. Nothing happens by accident. It doesn't always necessarily have everything to do with you consciously, but you are there for a reason, perhaps to serve what somebody else is going through. It is all orchestrated. You are that powerful. You may not know it. You are that harmonized. You are that powerful. So powerful you are unconscious of it. It has been created to be automatic in the background. So you don't even have to think about it. Just start knowing that no matter where you are, no matter where you wind up, no matter with whom, no matter what is going on, it is happening for a reason. And that reason is that you are part of an orchestration that might have a lot to do with you, a little to do with you, but always has something to do with your participation being needed in that orchestration in order for it to happen in the way that it needs to happen for all the participants in that particular moment. If you could only see, allow yourself to feel the beautiful orchestration, the powerful orchestration that you all are, you would walk through your day absolutely amazed, in awe and wonder of the synchronicity happening all around you. The more you focus on the idea that everything is synchronism, the more synchronism you will experience, the more you will actually be able to experience the orchestration and pretty soon it will be like walking through a magical dream, everything falling into place. 
you will see reality for what it is, a projection of your consciousness, a play on a stage, a beautiful complex play. It is amazing. Let it be so. My life is a synchronous orchestration. I am free to choose. I am free to choose. You are always free to choose. You are absolutely free to choose. That is your greatest gift. The greatest power you have from the unconditionally supportive and loving existence of all that is. You are free to choose. So choose. Exercise that power. Exercise that gift. You are free to choose, absolutely free. I am free to choose. <laughs> 